Yeah, big old, big like your hand. A tarantula is just as deadly. Uh huh. We used to have them on our property. We had, we lived on 2.5 acres of land in California, way up in the mountain. Have you all heard of Yosemite National Park? It's known the world all over. Everybody goes there. Yosemite. Uh huh. Everybody goes there when they come. They got to see that site. Uh huh. So we live right by Yosemite, where the wild animals and stuff was at. So every year, the spiders they come through. They like the size of your hand. Tarantula spiders. Yeah, they big. Me myself from Africa though. They'll. There are some huge spiders. So my son would catch one of them, you know, then he would take it to the city and show the people and scare the girls and have them running and going on. <laughs> yeah. But those things are dangerous. They're hairy. You know, you can see. The tarantula. Mm hmm. The tarantula. Yeah. I'm scared of those things. Very, very poisonous. And we have scorpions on our land. Uh, deers would come. We had mountain lions, you know, and we was blessed that by me having so many children, I'm blessed that none of them got snatched away. Even the eagles, huge, about your size, my size, can fly down and swoop up a person. Yep. Don't be out there with your baby and your back is turned. Your baby gone. Uh-huh. They scooping that water at a fast speed. Corona. Don't want to get the coronavirus. I don't blame you. Disinfect your hands and your arm. Very good. He's going to fill that barrel full of water as well. Uh-oh, be careful. The car is backing up. Be careful. The car is backing up.
I wonder what do they do with that water? Do they sell it to businesses? Because you know we do have a water problem here in Ghana. So um, are they selling it to like hotels, restaurants, uh, private homes? And um, wow, we got to check our water, where our water come from. Because they take this water and most likely Somebody hiring these young men to come out here and, and uh, fetch this water. And they probably take it and they purify it and sell it to the regular public. Wow. Now that's my assumption. I don't know. But they're not out here fetching this water for nothing. They're getting paid to do this. Yeah, people use it. They bathe with it. They uh, clean with it. And I heard that they even cook with it. Yeah. So I'm not sure. It's only my assumption, you guys. I'm not saying that's what's happening. I'm only assuming. And um, just trying to figure out what's up with that. How you doing? <laughs> How much? One CD. Let me see if I got one CD for you. I got to go back over to the car. You come over here. Okay, I'm about to do a little business transaction right here. <laughs> uh, can you uh, record me while I do her? Okay. Yeah, it's, it's already going. Join me to come out. Uh, no, you can stay right there. No, you have to speak the it's, it's already set. It's recording right now. As we speak. Hi, y'all. This is a little entrepreneur right here. She's selling her goods, and I'm about to purchase <laughs> one. What's, what is the name of that? <laughs> what is the name of it? What, what, you know, what do you call it? A buff rope. Buff rope. Buff rope. I'm about to pur purchase one. Okay, let me open the door so you can see what's going on here. Now tell them the name of it. Tell my people the name of this. That's a kind of boy The name is. It's one CD. One buff rope is one CD. And you, you can talk in tree too because you got a lot of Ghanaians. My second largest audience are people from Ghana. My first is the U.S. The second is Ghana. So you, you can go both ways. Okay, and I'm going to purchase one. One CD, y'all. Yeah, balcon. Yes, one CD. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. Let me have this one right there. Thank you. Madassi. Uh, you want to say Mr. Uh, Madassi? Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh, it's warm too. You you just got it out the oven? Because it's warm. Like yeah, it's just warm. I ain't going to say that. Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah. So that's what, 
how you say yes, you all. I ain't. I ain't. Uh-huh. Would you all like one? No, I'm okay. Would you like no, I'm okay. One? Thank okay. you. You're welcome. Okay, we're all right. Mm-hmm. What's your name? What is your name? Happy, happy. Oh, happy. Happy, okay. Well, smile, happy. <laughs> if you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Y'all remember that song? Y'all do, right? Yeah. Okay. Uko school way. Blessed home. Which in our class are you? Class five. Mm-hmm. Is it still recording? Hey, y'all. <laughs> Thank you for Stop. joining in and tuning into my it. channel. Huh? I thought you would break it and start eating it. Well, not just yet. I'm supporting. Later on, I'll eat it. <laughs> yep. Thank you. Bye-bye. You're on? Okay. Thank you, my sister. All right. These are my fellow farming sisters, you all. Yeah, we all... Have farmland up in from Pain. Yeah, Sister Alexandra and Sister Hi. Mabel. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What y'all got to say about that, y'all? I'm talking to you all. You too. What y'all got to say about the farmlands? Oh, we have a farmland at the waterfront, close to the lake. We are going to start organic farming. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. And then tell a little bit about the uh, farming group, the the women farming group. Okay, we have uh, we have an association called Women in Agribusiness. Mm-hmm. So it's like bringing all the women who are into agribusiness, not only farmers, but those who add value to it. Mm-hmm. And. Uh, we offer them training programs. Mm-hmm. You do your networking. You can sell your product, and also, um, you know, socialize. We socialize. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Very also, important. We yeah. solve our problems. Uh-huh. You know, sometimes you have a challenge. You put it on a platform, and mm-hmm. we all help you. We have a platform. Mm-hmm. We have the experts also there. Experts. We do. Um, we bring, sometimes we do bring um, a resource person to the platform, mm-hmm. then the person will be, you know, we choose a topic, maybe financial side or branding, marketing, and the resource person will take us through. Mm-hmm. And uh, if anyone is having challenges, then uh, they will that person will be addressed, mm-hmm. the challenging issue will be addressed. Right. Also, we have a mentorship mm-hmm. program. For instance, some people are, want to go into farming, but mm-hmm. they don't even know how to start. Mm-hmm. So when you come on to the platform, we take you through all yes. those courses, programs, mm-hmm. how you become a, a successful farmer, uh-huh. entrepreneur. Uh-huh. Anything that's oh, agripreneur. Agripreneur. That's a, is that a real word? Or you just made that one up. We well, use that often if, these if days. You have a, awesome. So some, <laughs> uh, for instance, hey. I'm agripreneur because uh, I'm into agri, agribusiness. Uh huh. Agriculture. So we have people who are also into coffee. So mm-hmm. I so am an agripreneur because I deal with those, fish products. Those who are uh-huh. into coffee are coffeepreneurs. Uh huh. I remember into into aquaculture. Uh huh. She's into fish. Uh huh. So. Aquaprene. Uh, aquaprene. Oh, aqua is for water. water. Okay. Yes. Prene. Uh-huh. So I'm also into livestock again. Uh-huh. I have a pig, so I'm a piggy friend. Piggy friend. Oh, so that's cool. So the, you all made those terminologies up, right? There's not in the dictionary. It's, 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 a, it's not being used uh, in Ghana and I haven't really found out whether yes, Is it in the dictionary? But, but yes. I'll find out but it's, it's, it's all over and it's understood You know, uh-huh. we have entrepreneur Let me just Yeah, I know about the entrepreneur, entrepreneur just, But I didn't know I'm that I'm an entrepreneur uh-huh. But I'm going to qualify a myself to into, a, a, yes. a Pacific entrepreneur 
specific thing that I'm doing. Uh -huh. So I'm into agriculture. So uh -huh. agripreneur. Agripreneur. Agriculture uh -huh. entrepreneur. Uh -huh. And aquapreneur. Agri aquapreneur. Water and coffee farming. Uh -huh. Do you understand? Uh -huh. If you are into horticulture, actually, it's there. It's on. It's on yeah, net. Agripreneur. Really? is defined as entrepreneur whose main business is agriculture agri what? or yes. agri-related. Mm -hmm. So, for instance, mm -hmm. since you are mm -hmm. novice into, like, you are novice, mm -hmm. you've not gone into farming before. Mm -hmm. When you come to the platform, we have other farmers or who are uh, already doing the farming right. who are on the platform. Uh -huh. It can help you, teach you, I mean, the nitty gritty. Right. Like, yeah. So that you, before you even start your farming, you have an idea. Right. We also teach uh, our, train our people, mm -hmm. mentorship, and also uh, we have a. Um, and, and how, to, how do I put it? We have a, a platform where once in a while we, we, we organize a market, mm -hmm. agribusiness market, area, area, area market, 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 where all the players will bring their products. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? You yes. can reduce it or whatever. Then we do like a, a show. Mm -hmm. uh, area uh -huh. markets. Uh -huh. We do markets so yes. that by doing this, we also do socialization by doing it. You know what this person is doing, you know this person, so you can refer. Mm -hmm. Right. Yes. Huh. So if I need a, a product, if I need a, a, a coffee, mm -hmm. I know that, oh, my sister also has a coffee. Uh -huh. So that, you know, mm -hmm. you can... Well, one don't have the other one half, and you yes. always can prefer refer someone refer over to someone, some, to what you don't have. Yes. Refer to the sister who do have. Yeah, I understand. Sometimes we do have opportunity to also travel. Uh -huh. Maybe there's a show somewhere, mm -hmm. there's an exhibition somewhere, conference somewhere. Mm -hmm. You know. Oh, right on. Now, okay, so I understand that there is a registration fee and a one-time yearly So uh, what fee. we do is, because it's an association, uh -huh. you know, we have to, you know, and uh, that apart from the agribusiness, mm -hmm. there are other bigger organizations, like Association of um, Industries. Mm -hmm. We have uh, NB, NBSSI. Do you understand? They are, they, no, they are the know. bigger umbrellas. Do you understand? No. So we no, are no, 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 I, I don't. I'm coming. Oh, okay. I'm coming. Okay. We are under them. Mm -hmm. So, the, as an association, as an area, we have to register with all these people and all involves money. Mm -hmm. So, before you join, you have to register. Mm -hmm. Registration is 50 Ghana cities and annual subscription is 100 cities. Mm -hmm. So, the registration is one time and the annual subscription, you pay it yearly. Mm -hmm. Every year you pay that. Mm -hmm. It counts as other benefits. Mm -hmm. We also look for funding for the women. Okay. Mm -hmm. Grants and uh, yes. loans and things like that. Yeah. So, uh -huh. so, so we, 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 you know, we are under uh, MBSSI. So okay, so what is the definition of that particular uh, abbreviation you just said? NBSSI. Uh, yes, what is it? National Board for Small, Small Scale, Scale Industry. Uh -huh. you, you know, recently, because of the COVID, uh -huh. the government gave a stimulus package mm -hmm. for all entrepreneurs, farmers, whoever. Mm -hmm. So, because we are under them, we have opportunity to, you know, get Tap into that more, resource. Yeah. Yes, uh -huh. and give it to our members. Uh -huh. yeah. Right, okay. So, the funds... Okay, it goes to those people. So, what? What do? How do they allocate the funds? Okay. First of all, you have to register with us. Uh huh. Once you're a registered member, we because we're under um, MBA, MBSSI, mm -hmm. we'll give them your your details. Do you mm -hmm. understand? Yes. You applied it, and we give you. Um, we give. Your details to MBSSI, or you apply directly, mm -hmm. but they will refer you to us mm -hmm. to make sure you know you are part of us to mm -hmm. for us to vouch for you mm -hmm. that they you get are the benefits good. that they yes. have to offer. Yeah, then your details will be there, so you can mm -hmm. get it through your bank, mm -hmm. your Momo, mm -hmm. or any other means. Mm -hmm. So yeah. now, those resources that they collect from people who register, do they? Um, Collectively, are they put to use to benefit the members? Yes. And, and um, like, 
Is that, are those funds, is it like for administrative work? Uh, yeah, okay. things it's like partly, that partly for administrative work mm -hmm. and then also for uh, the benefits of the members mm -hmm. if there's a program uh, the members are sponsored mm -hmm. so maybe you give you 50% of the cost yeah. of the whole program mm -hmm. so that mm -hmm. anybody who is an outsider pays the full but members pay and Half also price. for the running of the office because you need mm -hmm. we have personnel right. who man so you need to give them it, the, the position is is voluntary mm -hmm. but you still need to give some transport allowance and other things so that uh, represent the represent yeah. can work uh -huh. so it's for the benefit of the members and also to run the mm -hmm. office and okay also we that's what i want to hear that's what that, so they can plainly understand yeah. Yeah. break it down yeah. yes mm -hmm. also we, when we have money in our coffers, mm -hmm. like this COVID, mm -hmm. we can go and give some kind of thing to charity, hey, to yes. the homes that's, and other that's what to I want to hear. The Thank less you. Thank you. Uh -huh. So yeah. with this COVID, we can decide to, we are going to a maternity home, mm -hmm. we are going to children's home, we are going to female prison, mm -hmm. you know, to yeah. support them. So right. all this money will mm -hmm. come from. You know, yeah, those registration members, fees yeah, and member fees. Yeah, yeah. To see, that's what I wanted to hear. Yes. Okay, so the, the money has been put to good use. And also, it, you it know, serves a great, a greater purpose. Registration and other things. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right on, right on. That sounds wonderful. Very interesting. So now the umbrella that uh, we fall under, I say we because I'm about to register in, in <laughs> maybe next month. You know, when, 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 when my children send me some more money, y'all. Hint, hint, kids, if you hear me, okay? Because <laughs> um, it sounds like a very good uh, program. Uh, so the, the umbrella that we are under, now what is the abbreviation again? We have, um, we have uh, so many umbrellas. Mm -hmm. It's all composure. You see, area is structured that um, it's a women's group, mm -hmm. but we collaborate with other agencies Mm -hmm. with, this, with similar aims and objectives. Mm -hmm. So NBSSI, for instance, like we said, the National Board for Small Scale Industry. And that's Ghana. That's Ghana, uh -huh. yes. They also look at industry, but they are looking at the whole industry. Mm -hmm. But we are for only a Greek. Mm -hmm. So once we also register with them as an association, we benefit like an individual also registering. So on, on Friday, for instance, there's going to be a training program mm -hmm. and we've sent five of our members mm -hmm. to partake in it because we are also members of them. Mm -hmm. And we, we are also doing with other, um, right, currently we are in discussion with other groups mm -hmm. who are similar because we can't do it everything on our own right so we collaborate with uh -huh. with others of there's, the same objectives mm -hmm, there's power in numbers now do you have to be uh living in ghana in order to be part of this or okay, you, we, we define the woman in agribusiness to be any person any woman living in ghana mm -hmm. uh, any ghanaian mm -hmm. into agribusiness mm -hmm. or anyone in living in ghana mm -hmm. doing agribusiness and is a woman mm -hmm. Or a Ghanaian outside mm -hmm. who is also, some of them have their farms here, but they are not here. Right. So once you are in Ghana, you are linked with Ghana somehow, you qualify to be a member. Okay. Because the business is done in Ghana. Right, okay. Uh -huh. Yeah. All right. And we also have members who are not in Ghana, who yeah. are outside, uh -huh. but they deal in agribusiness. Here in Ghana. Products. Uh -huh. Maybe right. you do uh, exports. Mm -hmm. That's what I was doing. So you have to know. Mm -hmm. If you need information, if you need a product, mm -hmm. do you understand? Yes. You can get all the, you know, players mm -hmm. on the platform yes. who will supply you your, your product and mm -hmm. even ship it to you. Yes. Yeah. So now, what about the nonprofits? Uh, like myself, um, I have a, um, a NGO here in Ghana. Then I have a, a nonprofit in California, and what I did was support the farming women here in Ghana before. I, I became a farmer myself and so what I would do I would come here to Ghana uh, give them seed money and then also have the products shipped to me in to the US and then yeah. sell the products okay. uh, for the the farming mm. women mm. you know and so that's where uh, Dar's foundation and I did collaboration together okay. Okay. Uh, for years now maybe about six years or maybe longer than that yeah I think longer than uh, six years since 2010 Y'all do the math. 10 years. 
Okay, so that's how long I've been doing it. So even though I live in California and I have the nonprofit doing that, would that qualify me yes. as, okay. Because, you know, some of the NGOs, mm -hmm. they do it even though it's non-profit. Mm -hmm. You know, some of them do beats. Mm -hmm. Some of them do tie and dye. Mm -hmm. Some of them do use coconut mm -hmm. to do this uh, jewelry. Uh -huh. Do you understand? So they they do so many things mm -hmm. which qualifies you to because you are the, uh, you are a part of the agribusiness value mm -hmm. addition. You've added value to the uh, uh -huh. agri. You've added value to our uh, agri. Uh, Agapreneur. Let me Agri let me just that. let me just help her. Uh -huh. so, what we are, you know, I said Auntie, that. Patch your mommy, sanitizer. What you are saying is that once you are into a Greek mm -hmm. and you are connected with Ghana, you qualify. And you are a woman. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, you qualify to be a member of the group. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. So for you, are in California, mm -hmm. but you you do your business in Ghana. Right. Mm -hmm. you, you, and it's a Greek, mm -hmm. so you qualify. Okay. Yeah. Oh. I didn't know. Thank you yeah. for telling me. Well, I didn't even know about the business until y'all yeah. told me about it. So I'm learning. So you all hear that any uh, sisters out there in California or wherever you're at in the United States of America or wherever you're at in the world, and if you have any association with Ghana doing business, agribusiness, that qualifies you. As they say, it brings value. How do you say it? Value addition. Value, value addition. addition. Yes. Because uh, you see, we are trying to promote our work, uh -huh. uh, what we produce. Mm -hmm. Whether it's it's the primary source or even with the product, so even if you are into exports, mm -hmm. so we need that collaboration with our sisters also in other countries. Yes, because then we can have that international trade. Mm -hmm. Because you will take our goods here, we'll produce, and you take outside and sell it. Say, if you don't take it, the the, the goods are here, and mm -hmm. we are not growing as as business mm -hmm. women. So mm -hmm. so you are very much welcome on board mm -hmm. very to much interact welcome. with. The local producers mm -hmm. here, you, or even partner with them so mm -hmm. that you can have, if we are doing the primary product, you can also partner and have it processed, mm -hmm. add value to it, mm -hmm. but like she's saying, because if you add more value to it, then mm -hmm. you make more, uh, you make the Perfect. product more acceptable mm -hmm. yeah. and all that, the finishing and mm -hmm. everything is mm -hmm. okay. So Now, not to cut you off, either, yeah. neither one of y'all. Yeah. Before my camera stops on me, sometimes it shut down. Can you all please give your information, your contact information, uh, how to contact you in reference to any questions that the viewers might have? Okay, simple. We are on. Uh, you okay, can so, look for so, us on our, uh, Facebook, African Women in Agribusiness. Mm -hmm. All our details are there. You can look for us at, uh, on Instagram, LinkedIn. Um, Twitter mm -hmm. and also uh, for, for the WhatsApp we have to add you mm -hmm. but we have a, a contact number mm -hmm. where you can call us when you go to any of our social media platform mm -hmm. you find see our contact our email address and everything mm -hmm. so okay. African women in agribusiness Ghana mm. African you women in agribusiness Ghana. Ghana. Mm. Yes. Very important. Very important. Add Ghana at the end, you all. Absolutely. So this is my sister, Mabel. Mabel, uh -huh. yes. And this is my sister, Alexandra. So all of you should come on board. Get your shea butters. Get your processed pepper, tomatoes, ginger, mm -hmm. cashews. Onions. Cashews. Uh -huh. Now we have people doing, you know, uh, contumery. Uh -huh. Contumery in a can. Uh -huh. Do you understand? Uh -huh. Contumery in a can. Uh -huh. so you can take it outside. Yes. So you people should come on board. Uh -huh. Yes, and we're doing organic farming. Organic uh -huh. farming. Yes, and this is what's connecting the three of us together, you all. We uh, have taken a certain amount of uh, farmland to do organic farming. Integrated organic farming. Integrated organic farming. Absolutely. They have their own land and I have my own land. And we're doing something similar but but different. You know, so um yeah, absolutely. Hey y'all, uh, so thank you all. Thank you so much for sharing that information. I appreciate the both of you all. <laughs> and I will be joining 
next month, like I said, when them children send me some money. So y'all tell my kids, send me some money, y'all, <laughs> so I can join. You know, um, networking is very important, okay? Who you know and who you are connected with is very important. It helps. Sometimes who you know will get you further than what you know. Okay, then your skills sometimes, you know, <laughs> hey, because sometimes that's the way the world run in certain areas. But yeah, um, networking is very important uh, when you're doing business. Absolutely. All right, my sisters, thank you so much for that interview. <laughs> and, and, and plus, it was this is a raw, unprepared, unedited interview, unexpected interview. Okay, <laughs> but y'all, we did yeah, well. So you started by buying. The both fruit, and uh -huh. then it turned into interviewing the area members. Uh -huh. <laughs> so y'all give me thumbs up, thumbs <laughs> up, oh, thumbs up. That's working. Uh huh. <laughs> yes, absolutely. But you don't need much to come on board. You don't need much mm -hmm. to come on board. Yes, and so fifty CDs is like ten, less than ten dollars, you guys. One fifty yes. CDs. Uh huh. Fifty what? CDs. <laughs> less than. Less than. Less than third. Less than twenty. Let's say $20. Uh-huh. Y'all hear that? So it's nothing. Y'all come, come on and join. You learn so much. Absolutely. Yeah. And what you all shared, uh, the things that we will be learning is a wealth of information. Absolutely. And that's why I'm joining. Okay? Because I like what I heard. Straight up. All right, you guys. Africa to the world. Straight up. <laughs>